Yo, what do you do, everybody? I'm Archie Kobe having a good day. We got a Leatherface build for you today. And let me tell you, my first ever Leatherface build video? <laughs> it's one you're gonna wanna rock. This build is a absolute powerhouse. All right, a couple things we gotta note about Leatherface first is that he's kind of different from the rest of the killers. So first off, every time when he swings an attack, it does not consume any stamina. Just take a look right here for yourself. And the next unique thing about Leatherface is once his stamina bar is completely gone, you can still run with him and swing your attack still. It's like there's no need for his stamina bar at all, really. So now that you know those couple things about Leatherface, let's get into this build. So first one, we got Hysterical Strength. When below 15% stamina, you deal 20% more damage. So yeah, with this perk, you're always going to want to have your stamina really low. So just keep on running, keep on moving with Leatherface to have your stamina really low at all times because you'll get a free 20% more damage. The next perk is Big Swings. Attack damage is increased by 15%. But stamina consumption tied to attacks is 200% more costly. Now you already know Leatherface doesn't consume any stamina while attacking. So this is a free 15% extra damage on you. And now for the last perk, we got Blood Harvesting. Your damage is increased by 20% when carrying a full blood vial. So to activate this perk really quickly, what you wanna do is actually get your first kill really fast, and then that will fill up your blood vial, and then after that, you'll get 20% extra damage. I wouldn't recommend running around the basement picking up those blood buckets, that's just wasting your time. Just get that first kill, then boom, extra damage. So in total, if you get all three of these perks activated at the same time, that's 55% more damage. Now for the attribute points, what you wanna do is just max out your savagery to 50. Next up for endurance, you do not want to put any attribute points into this, because you want to use and run out of your stamina as quick as possible to activate this hysterical strength perk. So no points into endurance and now for blood harvesting you actually want to put your remaining points into blood harvesting. Now I know what some of you might be thinking if you have less points in your blood harvesting then you will fill up your blood way quicker right? Wrong. What some people forget to realize is that the more points you have in blood harvesting the more blood you actually get from killing victims. So I tested this out I went to a game with only 13 blood harvesting I got a couple swings off a victim and killed the victim and that still didn't even fill up my blood vial. But if you put points into this and have above 30 or just 33 and you and you get your first kill, that'll actually fill up your blood vial just by getting one kill. And not just that, your blood vial capacity will be over 100. So if you need to feed grandpa, you can give him that 100 blood and that will level him up one time. So again, be sure just to put your remaining points into blood harvesting because it's better than none. Now as for my ability, we got the overheat reduction. Then level two, we got stalling resistance. And level three, instant activation, baby. For our grandpa perk, we got brute strength, slightly increased melee damage for all family members. This will just stack up even more with this build. And last but not least, here's the skill tree. You go left and then straight up. But two of the three perks you need are actually random perks, so just keep respecting. The historical strength is random, and the violent perk is random. All right, hopefully you guys enjoy these games, and let's get it. Here we go, Leatherface with the instant start chainsaw. Boom! Just like instant ramen, baby. Mmm, tasty. Alright, let's go see if we can taste some victims over here. Let's see if they spawn on this side. Oh, someone's in that room. I heard him. Heard him open the toolbox. Open his door. What's up, baby? Mmm! Mmm! You ain't going nowhere. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. Let me just open this door real quick. Where'd you go, Connie? I hear ya. We're around here somewhere. Maybe not. She went back in there. 100% guaranteed. I might have to chop down that thing. She's in here. I don't think I remember closing that door. Is that a Julie? Oh, you're going nowhere, baby! Let's go! Three hits and you're dead? We had two of the three perks activated right there. We had historical strength because our stamina was super low. And of course, we had the power swing. And now, we have all three perks activated. We got Vital in here now. Let's go rip and tear until it is done. What's up, Sonny? I'm coming for you. I see ya. Watch this. And here comes the giant! Boom! One shot, baby! Yeah! Mmm! Feels good, don't it? You just got two more victims. Let's see. They all still down in here in the basement. They all still in the basement. Because none of them have enough points to have opened up doors. Where'd they go? I'm coming for them. I'm, I'm gonna go check over here now. Down all the way over there. You gotta watch out. Don't wanna overheat your chainsaw. You can't overheat this baby. Or you're screwed. Anyone over here? Nah, you lucky. Alright, I'm going back, going back. 
Let's see the score. All right, they all still down here in the basement. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I just saw someone. What's up? <gasps> oh, you lucky. You would have died one hit right there, boy. Johnny, he just passed you. Wait, what? There's an Nana down here? Oh, that's a Connie. All right, where'd Leland go? This is an easy game. That's how strong this thing is, boy. That's how strong this build is. All right, he went through there, that tunnel. Let's go ahead and see if we can cut him off. Hopefully, we can get our historical strength in here. Oh, he did. Easy games, baby. All right, here we go. Insta start. Mm. All right, let's see if we get some victims. Playing as Leatherface. Family house map. Got the home field advantage, if you know what I'm saying. Someone's over here. They went through here. Oh, first blood already? Mm, I missed. That was a miss. Don't worry, we're gonna get her. Oh my gosh, she's breaking my ankles. Got her one time. Oh, she knocked me down. <laughs> hey, that's okay. That's okay. We're gonna come back from this. Small setbacks, but for greater comebacks. You know what to say. All right, where they at? Come on now. Come on now. I gotta show you this OP build. Super strength of a leather face. Right now, we only have one perk activated out of the three. But once we get full blood and uh, less than 15% stamina, all of our perks will be activated. Okay, I can't find anyone right now. What is this? They are hiding from me. I just want to play, boys. Come on now. I just want to play. Oh, I think I just saw someone through this door. Oh, I see you. Oh, it's a Connie. I see you. One shot, one shot coming up. Boom! That's not a one shot, but hey, she's still dead. Let's go. Right then and there, we had two of the perks activated because our stam stamina was low. But now, we have all three perks activated because we got a full blood vial. And Grandpa has awoken. Look at that, baby. Three more victims. Let's get it. Oh my god, I'm going to have to cut this down, man. It's in my way. This thing's in my face. Leatherface tech. Mmm. Every time you chop one of those things down, swing your weapon. It's a little little cheeky tech. Shave a couple seconds off. All right, where are they at? Where are the rest of them? Where are the rest of them? Oh, I see a Leland. Target spotted, baby. Oh, God, I can't see anything, bro. He's going around. He's going around. Gotta watch out for my chainsaw. Boom! Oh, you lucky. I didn't have the overheat. Where'd he go? I'm coming. He's one shot. Watch this one shot. Yeesh! Mm. <laughs> this build, I'm telling you. OP. Strongest other face build. I right, we got two more victims. They both might still be down here. Not too sure. Let's go ahead and take a look. Then go over here. Open this up. That door's still closed. Let's go ahead and check that for sure. Yep, still locked. Oh, someone's over here. It's a Julie, baby. Come on, Julie. Where'd you go? Through here? Actually, oh, I see her. I can catch her. Let's go. Oh, she took a right. What a buffoon. You done messed up. Mm, one shot. We had all three perks activated right there. Oh, we got Diana right here. She's going to stab me in the back. Get her, let her, get her, hitchhiker. Get her. Hitchhiker, where'd you go? You left me hanging, bro. <laughs> Yo, that's messed up, dude. She's going to stab me again? No, nah, I'm out of here. Come here, baby. You give up? Oh, dang. She's a fighter. She ain't going down without a fight. I'm going to get her. I'm going to get her. We can get this four for four. We have to. Come on. Come on, Leatherface. She's over there. Here comes a giant boom. Here comes a giant boom. Say it with me. Here comes a giant boom. She's gonna eat it. Oh, that's a hitchhiker? I thought that was on that for a second. She's still in here. She has to be. You in here on the boy? No? Gotta be back here. Watch out for the chainsaw. Keep on feathering that chainsaw. Don't let it overheat. 
Oh, she's over here. The bones are shaking. Bones are shaking. She's not over here. What the hell? Dang, where is she, yo? Oh, she's over here. She's dying. Mm, that's my kill, man. All right, GG's. So get